I remember a day I was um, I was probably around around 14 years old, and um, I grew up in Brooklyn, New York, Brownsville, Howard Houses, projects in Brooklyn, and um, one of my real good friends. We used to play football in the neighborhood a lot, and American football. And um, there was a bunch of guys that we always used to play football together. And um, it was one day in particular that I, I just remember this day because it, it kind of stands out to me. We had just finished playing football. And around that time, we're talking about the, we're talking about the 80s. Um, around that time, the, the thing in New York, in Brooklyn, was that people would, the young kids would go out and, and snatch people's gold chains and pocketbooks from ladies and they just would rob people. And um, this particular day, some of the guys that we played football with were bad guys. They were already doing this stuff. And my best friend at the time, he decided that that day that he was gonna go hang with these guys and go on out on the shopping area and rob people. And I remember him saying, yo, you wanna, you wanna, you wanna come? Let's go. Come on, let's go with me. And at that moment, I had to make a decision on what I wanted to do. And if I wanted to go with them, or if I didn't want to go with them. I just decided that I was going to let them go ahead and go do that, and I was going to go home. And from that day, in that minute, our lives, me and my best friend's lives went completely different directions. He became you know, a neighborhood criminal, Got arrested many times, got into a lot of trouble. Um, his life was, not, and, 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 and I went the complete opposite direction. I went to college, I got you know, good education, and became something in life, and he, you know, three, four bids in jail. And in that one minute, that decision of, do I go and be with the, the cool, tough guys, bad guys, that's you know, doing bad stuff on the streets, or do I just, on my own, with nobody else telling me, just make the decision to just go home and do something else. And if I hadn't made that decision that day, I probably wouldn't be standing here in France right now talking to you. If I would have done that that day, I might have liked it, it might have been exciting to me, it might have been fun, and a couple of arrests, and your life is completely a different different life. I always remember that day as it stands out to me. In that, in that, in that quick New York minute, the decision that I made and, and how it how it how it you know affected my life